Welcome back to Is It True News. As always, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but it could be good news depending on how you look at it. So I get right to the point, because the explanation of the point will take longer. The decision has been made by those in charge, those appointed, some people call them earth angels, guardians, um, spirits God sent to walk among us, whatever you call them. This, the decision has been made that humanity is not worth saving. And the reason, and you're, you're will say, oh no, only God could decide. Well, humans got to be such a problem in the universe. God left it up to the caretakers, it's what I call them. The angels, the spiritual beings that come live among us that try to guide us through our conscious and remind us what's right and wrong all the time. And they have decided humanity, humans, are not worth saving. Or well, I actually... I actually agree with them. It has to do with, yes, that people are bad, some people are bad, some people are evil, and those people will always be that way. But the bigger problem is all of the people that choose to do nothing when they see something wrong is the biggest problem. For instance, when Obama decided to take over all food production, his sole purpose was to make sure animals suffer more because that's what Luciferians do. They want more suffering and more pain. And so people who eat animals that have been in pain will be in pain and be depressed because that energy flows back into you. And the pig farms, the pigs aren't, can't even stand up. The pregnant pigs, they can't even stand up. Lay in bed. Try to lay in bed for three days. After a day, your legs are going to hurt. Because there's no circulation. And the amount of agony these animals go through in one day is beyond imagination. Yet people do nothing to stop it. And of all the horror that Obama created through redoing the food production... To make sure animals have the, the maximum suffrage. Gosh, most people didn't want to do anything because, oh, he's the first black president. We can't do anything about him. First black president. First black president. I don't want to be called a racist. First black president. And that's exactly why they cheated his way into the office. He wasn't voted in. He had a bunch of rich Jewish backers. And that's another thing you have to wake up to the fact that Jewland is about the Bob America land. We've given them everything. And they want to destroy us. But it doesn't really matter anyway. It's hum humans are not worth saving. And I, I could repeat that all day, but I, I think if you sat and thought about it for a minute, you know what I'm talking about. From the school kid that may get picked on or punched on the bus or not called to join the team or to the, to the employee that other employees decide to pick on for whatever reason. To the animal that's tortured. For people who just cannot give up meat to eat because they have to have it on their plate no matter how much suffering something has to go through I myself personally I don't I don't eat meat I haven't since I was 14 but if I were to eat meat I would want to make sure that the animal at least had a happy life not a miserable life 
and not growing vegetation under miserable conditions either because they have frequencies as well. And they're, they're, that's the other reason too. You know, I've been telling people for the longest time to play those frequencies out loud, pray out loud, pray outside. You know, it only takes a few minutes a day. We, we could have avoided these disasters because the frequency is what causes all those hurricanes. And all people had to do is play 528 megahertz, 432 megahertz, and 936 megahertz. And out loud, and they didn't. So, anyways, that, that that's pretty much it. I, I'm going to stop it here. I, I don't want to just to beat a dead horse, but 144,000 protectors on Earth said we are not worth saving.